to say I didn't mind it too, really. I minded the story more than the game. I actually liked the game. Yeah, the gameplay was fun. I mean, yeah, it was a couple of girls playing dress up, and I mean, half the times you only use one dress for for the entire game. I mean, if you made everyone the gun person early on, you can get uh, trigger time level three within like a couple hours, and then just literally just spam that at all times. But uh, I think they, the way they redid it there, I think that really led on to how they were gonna do twelve. Like they 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 they, they with. Final Fantasy X 2, they started loosening it up a bit. I mean, the rest of the games are just standing in a line, okay, my ATB is full, let's attack. And then I think Final Fantasy XII, or X 2, really brought on how 12 was going to be. And, I mean, 12... What makes you say that? I'm curious. Well... No, 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 I want to know why you say it brought on that. Because, honestly... Chen 2 actually goes back to earlier in the series to around 5. The whole dress sphere concept came from 5. Well, no, 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 no. I wasn't talking about the dress sphere thing. I think the, the, the whole battle system overall, like, it actually took time to, com do, to do the commands. You just went, like, everything just went freeze, and then you just kind of go, like, okay, I'm going to go run up and attack and No. They, they put into effect, like, very subtly, but they did still put it into effect that, okay, if one girl is all the way over here and their target is all the way over there, then it has they have to walk that certain distance, and that actually takes cert a certain amount of battle time to do so. And I think because of that, they started experimenting more and more. Also with uh, Final Fantasy XI, if any of you have played the online game of it. I haven't, actually. I wish I did. Um... They, they started thinking, let's loosen it up a little bit, and that's I think that's where they came up with 12's idea, which is, yes, there's still a little bit of turn-basedness, it takes a little bit of time to cast a spell, which, I mean, it's perfect, that's perfectly normal, I mean, you can't just literally be like, okay, yeah, I'll use fire, 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 no, you have to sit there and be like, yeah, but a little bit of fire, I mean, uh, like, like Eternal Darkness, they, they do very well at the whole magic casting thing in Eternal Darkness, because they sit there and say, yeah. okay, we have to chant. Uh, you are a salty potato heal spell not just okay heal spell random um I, I went on a roll there and I lost my train of thought <laughs> uh, yeah yeah they, but they they still had the whole ATB thing and they uh I mean there were times where there weren't battles and stuff and they would kind of deform and stuff but they still had the whole they, they started losing the whole structured battle phase thing and I think that really came from uh, yeah. Ten Two because they tried to make it more looser. They they tried to make it looser in Ten Two, and they succeeded. I, I must say the gameplay in Ten Two is good. It's just everything else Ten Two is just kind of uh, no thank you. The storyline is really really bad. I'm so it's sorry. Ridiculously I have to bad. Say that it was unnecessary. It, not the fact that it's a happy story. That's fine with me. They could have made a happy story, yes. But the fact that they continued on to 10, off of 10 was what made me angry. Because 10 ended very well. Yeah. And then it was basically yeah. just uh, Yuna sitting around <laughs> being all well. sad and stuff because Titus wasn't there. And that's pretty much the only thing that happened. She was just sitting around all sad, and she's like, oh, wait, that person looks like Titus. Let's go on a 70-hour adventure because of it. And anger people with annoying minigames that kept them from getting 100%. So that they couldn't get the new game plus with the Moogle Sphere Grid. Sorry, that, that's just a little personal angst there, but... You don't have to get 100% to do the Moogle thing. Yeah, you do. To get the, you don't uh, have to win the Sphere Break game. No, you don't. The, the, no, the, the official the, guide? No, from... to get the Moogle one. No, I've got the official guide back there. It, no, you just have to, like, complete all the missions. Or, like, do the missions. Yeah, and part of the mission is doing the, uh, the, the, the gun minigame, and I couldn't do it. Yeah, but you can... Yeah, the, the oh, one... Oh, that's the minigame. Oh. I cannot do that minigame. No, no, no. I thought... No, no, no. I thought you were talking about the, um... The speaker break one. Oh, no. I never did that. 
Yeah, if you, you can lose that one and still get the mascot. Uh, it never said mission complete, and I tried it like 50 times, so I just kind of gave up on the game there. Watched Loki play it. <laughs> yeah, and I, like I said, it, it, it was unnecessary is why I don't like it. Healing item. Sorry, it was just there. Actually, that was the map. Oh, uh, whatever. It was the map. So we went from Haunting Ground to Silent Hill to Final Fantasy to Final Fantasy X. Let's go well, back to our main point. Well, let's go to Final Fantasy XII. Oh god. Well I, well, I think we covered everything in our main topic. Let's go to Final Fantasy XII. I never now, finished this, Josh's by the way. Silver Moon was good. Oh, I never finished XII either. I got to... Uh, I got to a certain point and just stopped playing because I couldn't take anymore. I think they made it too lazy. They gave you these gambit things and you can pretty much uh, get through an entire map without, with like barely touching the uh, left analog stick. I mean, yeah. Yeah, and you uh, also had the issue of the fact that, um, the story was not. The story was kind of. It was you were so open ended. You kind of didn't know what. No, you were so open ended that you kind of what weren't sure what to do at some point. Yeah, I had to use a guide. But um, in my opinion, it played more like an MMO. Uh, I mean, there's just what? so. In my opinion, it played more like an MMO. Uh, massively multiplayer online game. Uh, it, there was like a whole. There, I mean, there was too so quiet. much. I can't hear uh, you. Eh, why am I suddenly quiet? Bad microphone. Be loud again. Turn the phones on, please. Let's see. Maybe this. Am We're I gonna ramble on forever, aren't we? Yeah, we are. We tend to do that. Yeah, we just get to talk in it, and it's really cool. Um, what is going on on your screen? Anything? Uh, I'm sitting there, in Froggy Fiona, crouching. She's probably nodding off by now. You should, like, yeah. <laughs> I'll run in circles! But like I said... But yeah, 12 was a bit kind of too open-ended for me. I couldn't play it because it was that open-ended and I couldn't figure out, you know. I, I got so sidetracked because I, I actually got it. Had a, I got a guide and I was like trying to play it and it was so open-ended that I couldn't do anything. I was trying to do side quests because I didn't know when I wasn't supposed to do side quests. I mean, it, it, there's also like, oh yeah, if you open this chest, you have a 10% chance to get this item. But and then sometimes it'll respawn, but sometimes it won't. And then you want to constantly go back and get the ch the item that you're supposed to be getting, and then you end up getting so wound up and trying to get items and stuff. Like I remember there's this one like pyramid or ancient ruin thing that I had to go through, and like there's this like really good sword at the bottom of it, and I and I took like two days. Literally just going around and around that place trying to get this one chest, and it had a really nice sword in it. And then I grinded for a while to make sure that everyone could equip it and stuff. Then I'm like, wait, what am I supposed to be doing? It plays too much like an MMORPG. I'm sorry. It's literally like they tried to make like an offline yes, version of that Eleven, did. but different. That did. It, it, I I've never played Eleven. I wish but I did. But I would say that the, control, the controls for um, 12, you know, they play like that. And that's how it should have stayed. If they were going to do that with 12, they should have made it freaking MNO. If they were going to try and do real, real, you know, real turn-based combat, then they should have done something.